let me just ask you about a couple of uh, images that sort of jumped out at me and uh, how you did that. What are, the, what are the tricks of the trade? There's a lovely shot of your subjects standing with a framed picture with the chromosomes in them. How, how do you do that? Uh, I carried lots of empty frames around the world with me. <laughs> um, I bought them and I went, right, these six, um, or these eight, I think we had eight, because we had to work out in the setting. And we, we just carried them. I had a blank white sheet of paper in them. We worked with a graphic, a big tip. I mean, anyone who makes films would know this, but you talk to your CGI and graphics people before you go and film, not when you come back. So we worked out what colour card, what sort of little frame references we needed in the card. Um, for some of them, they had shiny things. We had a silver ball to get reflection to make sure that everything matched. Um, it was relatively simple, that one. So it was just an empty frame with a white that we keyed in. Uh, and we had very little time. We had only like a day, a maximum of a day. Ray Newsom, we had four hours with him total. And he wasn't very well, as you might have been able to see. He's still alive. He's now 17 and a half. He's now defying the odds. He's now gone way beyond what's expected. And his mum told me a, a couple of weeks ago that, you know, he's, he's okay. He's not getting up as much and can't do the stairs anymore. But, yeah, we did, we did carry the frames around white card and asked everybody to hold it. Mm -hmm. What about the... Did you do a similar thing when you had the, the frames on the wall and there's a, a pregnant woman with changing clothes yeah, and so on? Yeah, that was, that was an idea I'd had about um, wanting... Uh, the issue we had was how to make this feel intimate, that it was part of all of our lives, so that it wasn't just this immortality. You know, we're all a bit sceptical when we hear about immortality. Let's be honest. We go, oh, yes, another film about living longer. Oh, yes. I'm trying to go, no, this is real, and this is about all of us. And I was thinking about how we all store memories in our lives, and we have our photos on the, on the mantelpiece or on the wall or wherever we have them and we record the moments in our lives. And I thought, actually, what this whole film's about is about all of us wanting to hang on to the precious things, which is the people we love and the times that make us happy and the things that we honour and care for in our lives. So I wanted uh, a reflection of that. Um, so we shot that in a studio. Um, we had lots of frames borrowed from everywhere under the sun. I'm still filling the glass back in all these years later. I still find frames in my house that have got no glass. <laughs> um, and we brought the graphics team in and uh, we did Steadicam. So there was a bit of Steadicam in the, in the film, Steadicam along that. We didn't want it to look too steady and too perfect. And we wanted to dirty it up a lot. So quite a bit of work, believe it or not, went, up, went into the jittering and the, and the wobble. And, and normally it's, you know, Steadicam's perfect. And I went, no, 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 I want it just feeling a little bit bumpy. Um, and I think it worked. It just stops it feeling too polished and too slick. I didn't want it mm. looking like an ad. Okay, I'll ask you just one more question about images. There's a beautiful image in San Francisco of a car, and then you have this huge container ship going past in the background. And I was sitting there, I was watching, and I thought, how did you do that? It's very well spotted. Yeah. Um, it's a mat. Um, <laughs> it was, we actually waited for so long, because dear Len Hayflit, um, didn't like driving our car. Um, so it took us an awfully long time to get every single shot of the cars. And so I ended up having to keep the hire car and say, Len, thank you very much. And, and he went home. And then I'd drive it around. Um, but uh, the shot was rolling for so long that it just happened to have a ship go through and it was a lock off. And so we were able to map the two shots together. Okay. So it was just one of those little moments.